Yo, what's going on YouTube? Today we're showcasing the top 5 meta loadouts for Rebirth Island. Starting off with the car and the BP-50 conversion kit. Let's get right into it, man. So, for the muzzle with the car, we're rocking the Sonic Suppressor L. We're using this for bullet velocity and damage range. Now, for the barrel, we're rocking the Bryson Carbine Barrel. We're using this for ADSB and movement ADSB. Now, I'm coming in with the optic. We're using the Ranger Collar 4 optic. Now, for the ammo, we're using the high grade rounds for bullet velocity and damage range. And last but not least, we're using the tactical sling for the sprint to fire speed and ADS movement speed. Now, there's not a whole lot you can do for the BP-50. So here we go. We are rocking the castle brake for the muzzle, high grain rounds for the bullet velocity. Then we're using the first laser for the ADS and sprint to fire speed. And then last but not least, we're, and last but not least, we're using the IV grip tape, man. Overall, crazy build setup for the BP-50. Even though it got a nerf, but it's still good to use. And this is coming in at number five. Moving on to number four. Now number 4 we're using the MTZ556 and the Super 46. We have the Cassis brake for the muzzle of course. Boom heavy support for the under barrel. MTZ Drifter heavy long barrel for the effective damage range and bullet velocity. Jackless optic. I like this optic a lot. You guys can pick up whatever optic you want. But I definitely recommend this optic when it comes to the MTZ. And of course we got the 50 round mags. We gotta have that for this bad boy man. Now moving on to the SMG, we're rocking the Zen Compensated for the muzzle, DR6 for the underbarrel, high grain rounds for bullet velocity and damage range, 40 round mag of course we need as much ammo as possible, and if you guys don't have this stock, the Jack Cutthroat, this is the best stock ever for this SMG, you move so fast with the straight speed man, definitely must need it. Moving on to number 3, we're using the Hogar 26 in the MTW conversion kit, let's get right into it man. Now we're rocking the VT7 Spitfire Suppressor for the muzzle. Now for the barrel, we're rocking the Holger Factory barrel for the damage range and bullet velocity. High grain, ran, high grain rounds for the ammo. And we're rocking the 20 for the rear grip. And the Crow equals I for the optic. You guys can pick whatever optic. Once again, it doesn't matter, but this is the crazy optic for the Holger 26. Now we're moving on to the MCW conversion kit. This is the best class when it comes to the MCW conversion kit. There is a lot of classes you guys can make that fits your perfect playstyle. But for me, this is the best one when it comes to using this gun. Especially when you want to use it as a sniper support. I just threw it in with the Holger just because it is one of the guns that you guys can still use as an SMG. So definitely still give this a try. And this is the MCW conversion kit. Moving on to the next class. Next class we are rocking is the SVA 545 and the FJX Horus, man. These are one of the best guns in the game as of right now after the update. So definitely, if you want to rock any class out of all the classes I done showed y'all, definitely get ready for this one, man. So we are rocking the VT Spitfire Suppressor as well for the SVA. We're using the STV barrel for the SVA. As you guys can see, it gives you the most bullet velocity and damage range. So definitely slap this on. And you're also going to switch this into burst fire mode. Not automatic, burst fire mode. High gear rounds for the damage and bullet velocity. Definitely must need it. 60 round mag, of course, need as much ammo as possible. Especially when you're 1v4 or if you're playing quads in general. And last but not least, we're rocking the Crow Eagles Eye Optic, man. Now for my baby, I love this SMG so much. We're rocking the Zen Compensated for the muzzle. High gain rounds for the bullet velocity and damage range. 48 mag, of course. I can't wait till the 60 is able to be unlocked. This thing is going to be nasty, man. And we have the Ripper Light Stock. And last but not least, we're using the Light 90 Barrel, man. Now, if you guys want a little bit more damage, you guys can definitely use the Long Barrel. It'll give you more. But in general, I like this SMG to be fast and smooth. And you're snatching cameras like crazy with this SMG. Please give it a try and let me know in the comment section if y'all rock with it, man. Now, let's move on to the last and final class setup. And the last one is the car and the best SMG build ever, man. Let's get right into it. Alright, the number one class for Rebirth Island, man. We got the Car 98, and then I got the craziest Super SMG ever that you guys will want to try. This SMG is disgusting. By far the best one ever. Let's get right into it, man. So, we are using the last barrel for the car for the effective damage range and bullet velocity. Definitely need the high grain rounds on for more bullet velocity and damage range. Now, we are rocking the first laser for ADS and Sprinter Fire Speed. And this scope is a must-needed scope, the Crayo 13X VRS. 
Cause the last attachment that you will need is the stalk and it makes the scope look 10 times weirder. But trust me, once you get it down pat, it is disgusting. The no stalk, man. The no stalk with this scope on Rebirth Island is disgusting, man. I'm telling y'all, definitely want to give this bad boy a try. It is nasty. Moving on to the SMG. We have the Zen compensated for the muzzle. Y'all already know the drill. We gotta have this muzzle. Zulu OP3 light barrel for the barrel. This is by far one of the favorite barrels in this game when it comes to ADS and with this SMG. I'm telling y'all, this gun, this gun moves like the wind. We got 40 round mag, of course, that is much needed. And we got the jack cutthroat for the stock. Look at this, 15% and the barrel gave us 12. Bro, the ADS strength is disgusting. I'm actually show y'all one before this video is over. And last but not least, we're rocking a model 2023 for the optic, man. Let me show y'all what I am talking about with this SMG, bro. Look at this. Bro, the strafe is insane. And while firing, bro, you move like the wind, bro. This thing is disgusting. Look, like, bro, I'm not even... It's like I'm not even done walking. Like, it's the same speed as walking left to right. And you... Bro, what? I'm telling y'all. This SMG is disgusting. If you want to break cameras, definitely slap this bad boy on, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to your boy. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.